19 injured as Hezbollah fires swarm of drones at Israeli targets. Lebanon's resistance movement Hezbollah says its fighters have fired a swarm of drones in northern occupied territories in retaliation for Israel's attacks on Lebanon. Hezbollah said in a statement on Tuesday that it launched an air attack with a squadron of suicide drones that targeted two Israeli military positions in Nahariya, the northernmost coastal city. The drone attack, it said, was a response to an airstrike on the southern village of Eba on Monday. Hezbollah also said four Lebanese fighters were killed in Israeli airstrikes on an area near the southern city of Nabatea. No further details provided. Israel's medical officials said 19 people were evacuated to hospital in Nahariya, one in critical condition. And the regime's military acknowledged that a number of drones were fired toward its positions on Tuesday, but they could intercept it only one of a number of aerial vehicles. According to military experts, the reason that Israel's Iron Dome wasn't able to track except for one drone does reflect the fact that the Lebanese resistance movement is growing more capable of following Hezbollah drone attacks and prior to a televised speech by Hezbollah leader Sayed Hassan Nasrallah, Israeli warplanes broke the sound barrier for several times by frying at very low altitude, over the capital city and a number of other areas. The warplanes caused such loud booms that sent people in the city running for cover. They said booms were the loudest heard in Beirut in years. Later in his speech, Nasrallah said that the sonic booms were intended to provoke those gathered for the memorial of Hezbollah's top-ranking military commander, Fuad Shakr, who was killed in an Israeli airstrike on a building in the southern Beirut suburb of Dehi on July 30.